what we've seen so far is I've certainly not seen reports of any hospitalizations or deaths um, from people that have been uh, infected with Omicron. So we don't yet know whether it's more um, lethal or um, or it has it causes more severe disease. So we need to just wait and see what that looks like. Um, the second point about how do we know it, whether it's going to be vaccine resistant is we don't have time here in the UK to wait for variants to be shipped over or, or grown up. So I would imagine that um, MHRA and Public Health England are now um, basically creating that variant and testing vaccines um, against it now. It's, it's not something you can do overnight, but, but we will get data, I would have thought, in, you know, within a week uh, as to whether or not the vaccines work or don't. I mean, clearly there's a concern because there's a bunch of mutations that are in a different place and look like they could be concerning. But at the moment, uh, I uh, would still assume that these vaccines will have efficacy. The question is, do they have the same level of efficacy 